Hi everyone, it is a very busy end of the spring semester here at OTC with a lot of ceremonies and graduations, many of them happening here at the Galois Theater here in downtown Springfield. Of course, hundreds of people will be turning out for the GED graduation to be held here, the middle college graduation, and the capping and pinning ceremony in the OTC nursing program. And of course, the 2012 OTC commencement ceremony will be held Thursday, May 17th, 6 o'clock in the JQ Arena on the Missouri State University campus. We will have highlights of the ceremony next month. It begins in a theater. Back here at the Galois Theater, which is the home of the OTC Fine Arts Program, the OTC Theater students and instructors put their talents to the test on this theater's stage the last weekend in April with the annual spring play. This year they put on quite a show performing the Neil Simon written play, The Good Doctor. The same weekend as the spring play, other OTC programs showcase their talents during the annual OTC Community Day. The event is designed as a way for the college to say thank you to the community for its support. The participating programs show their skills in a real-world atmosphere. The automotive program hosted a car show, the turf and landscape department held a plant sale, the welding program accepted donations for the March of Dimes for welding repair work that they performed. Other programs such as the Fine Arts Department had students perform, several allied health programs performed basic health screenings and the culinary program sold food and refreshments. Money received from the event helps to pay for student contests. It is estimated more than 1,000 people attended this year's event. There is another educational opportunity for OTC students thanks to a new agreement with Missouri Southern State University that provides OTC students and alumni who have an Associate of Applied Science or Associate of Science degree to transfer to MSSU to earn their Bachelor of Applied Science degree. We are so delighted to be able to partner with OTC. This is a great institution. Uh, we believe that there's a seamlessness about education in the state. We're all doing the same thing. We're all trying to help students to be successful and to be with an institution that is, the, is really focused on students and, and their welfare is a wonderful for us. We believe the same thing and so we are delighted to be a partner with you in this uh, venture. OTC students are eligible to apply for scholarship offered by Missouri Southern. Information is available at mssu.edu. The generosity of the Jared family was recognized. The Information Commons Atrium is named in the family's honor. The Jared family was involved in the OTC Foundation's first capital campaign right from its beginning and were the first to present a lead gift in support of the Center for Workforce Development Initiative, a part of the OTC Foundation's now completed capital campaign. The official naming of the Jared family atrium in the Information Commons is an opportunity to thank the family publicly for their support with the leadership, with the uh, administration, with the faculty, with the board, uh, they will find ways to make it happen because there is such a tremendous need. You may have heard some applause ringing across the OTC Springfield campus recently. The five leadership OTC classes decided to honor Dr. Shirley Lawler by having a tree planted near the ITTC building in her honor. After a stellar career in education, Dr. Lawler has decided to retire from Ozarks Technical Community College. Dr. Lawler's last official day is June 30th, but she will be teaching a few classes for OTC in the fall semester. And that is it for now. Of course, if you have any story ideas, please let me know. Thank you again for your time. I'll talk to you next month.